Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Elijah. I'm here with another episode of Elijah Plays Minecraft, and today we're going to be going over how to get music into your plots on Diamond Fire. First, we're going to have to start out with downloading this mod. So, just go ahead and enter this link, and I'll link it into the description, top link in the description. So, if you want to go check that out uh, instead of typing it, go ahead and do that. Uh, select which download you want to do if you wanted it for 1.16 or 1.15. Uh, 1.15 is better for Diamond Fire right now because that's basically the update that we're on. So, I'm just going to go for 1.15. Really doesn't matter. Just depends on what you prefer. I already have the file, but I'm just going to re download it for the sake of showing you guys. Now, once it's downloaded, all you have to do is go into your folders. You have to type percent app data percent, no spaces. Click enter. You see this dot Minecraft right here? Go ahead and double click that to open it up. Now, uh, we're going to want to go ahead and go to mods and make sure you guys already have the fabric downloaded. Uh, it's fabric loader. It allows you to load uh, mods. If you don't have that already, I'm sure you can find uh, mini tutorials on that on this on uh, YouTube. So uh, now what we're gonna do is go to the file, and then we're gonna go ahead and go into our mods. I see, I already have it here, but all you would have to do is drag that into there. Uh, I'm gonna pretend like I dropped it already because I don't need to. But once it's in there, you have it and you're ready to go. Go ahead and launch Minecraft with the fabric version. And then from there, we're gonna have to start selecting what music we want. So actually yeah, Megalovania, cause that's pretty popular. M-I-D-I. -I. That's the type of file you want. So that's why I did that. Uh, let's do download. Thank you, server. Yeah. So now that we find the download, we're just gonna go ahead and click download. Also, we're gonna need a uh, application called Minecraft Noteblock Studio. Let's go ahead and download that. Download installer. Um, open the installer, click yes. And just agree to everything until it installs. All right, and then once that's installed, you wanna go ahead and open it. So let me find where the heck I put that at. Okay, so now that we have Minecraft's Noteblock Studio downloaded and opened, we're gonna go up to File up here and we're gonna go ahead and import from MIDI. Okay, we're gonna go to where we downloaded, probably in your downloads and go to there. All right, so we're doing this. Import. And now we go ahead and play. And it sounds like what you expected. Uh, now we're gonna go ahead and save it. Save as new file. And then we're gonna go ahead and go to that percent app data percent like we did earlier. And then we're gonna go ahead and go to dot Minecraft. And then we're gonna go to code utilities. And then we're gonna go to MBS files. And uh, yes, I've already downloaded this twice, but my video keeps messing up. So I'll just delete these. Maybe I will. There we go. Mega Lovania. All right, and then we're gonna go ahead and click save. Perfect, now that we have that saved, we can go ahead and close everything and open Minecraft. All right, so now that we're in Diamond Fire, we're gonna have to go ahead and get our stuff set up. So let's go ahead and decide where you wanna call this music. I'm just gonna do it on join. So when the player joins the game, we're gonna do some stuff. So now there's going to be a new command you can do with slash NBS. If we click enter, it shows you the two commands. So first let's do slash NBS player. It's gonna give you this function. It's actually just a template and we're gonna go place it down. And then we're gonna pull out these three functions from there and just delete the rest of this. So once you have these three functions, you're just gonna to wanna to go ahead and place these somewhere. So this is your load song, play song and play note. So Oops, there we go. Boom. And then we're gonna go ahead and delete those from our inventory. Now, basically, all you need to worry about is the following. Well, after we get the file. So if we do MBS load and then you know, the file name, so Mega Lovania or whatever you called it, it will give you the, oops, it will give you the song. Easy peasy, and squeezy. Now I just gotta place this down. It's not even that big. So, oh my god, oh my god, I can't move. There we go. And it's only like three things long. It's basically just giving all the notes and whatnot. 
So now what we can do if I grab a call function and we go ahead and place it wherever you want to do it, undoing it, unjoin. And first thing we want to do is select the song. So Megalovania. Cool. Now what we're going to do is call the next function, which is load song. So it's going to load that song. And then the next thing we're going to do is actually play the song. So play song. Literally, that's all it takes. I mean, the downloading took a bit, but once you have it downloaded, all you have to do is convert your songs and then type. And once this, these three are in your plot, all you have to do is load the song and place it down and then call it wherever you want to call it. Easy as that. It's super easy. Now let's go ahead and play. And if it's ever like lagging and sounding weird, that's just uh, that's just the server or your uh, or your computer just lagging. It's nothing to do with this, okay? Uh, so that is pretty much it. I hope you guys found this tutorial useful. I know when I figured out about the uh, this mod, I was super excited and it was amazing. Congrat or thank you to the uh, developers of this mod. You guys did amazing. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe for more Diamond Fire tutorials, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.